Hello, we're going to look at the effects of electron excitation and de excitation. When you provide energy to an electron, it can jump to a higher energy level. That might be thermal energy, that might be a collision with another particle, or that could be an incoming wave of the electromagnetic spectrum. When that electron de-excites, it will release energy as a wave of light. Now that light might be in the visible part of the spectrum. And it all depends what atom you're considering as to what wavelength of light will be released. So that means we can get some different colours as a result and it looks really good. I've got here some different metal ions and I've put some distilled water in each of those. I'm going to add some ethanol as a fuel and the mixture of ethanol and the metal ion will burn and produce different colour flames. So I need to take my ethanol, bearing in mind that it is flammable, highly flammable, and I'm going to place about five millilitres into each of my different metal ions here. And then I need to make sure that the rest of the ethanol is well away from the experiment. I'm now going to ignite the ethanol and it will burn a blue colour but once it mixes in with the metals that I've got here we'll start to see some different colours as a result. But this works best uh, with the lights dimmed so So as you can see, lots of different beautiful flames are being produced. It all depends on what um, atom that you've got, what element that you've got, as to what flames we have. So for example, we've got potassium on this end here, and this produces uh, a nice lilac flame, sodium in yellow, copper in a nice blue-green, strontium is that brilliant red over there, we've got lithium as a nice uh, reddish flame, and a nice green for boric acid here. So this is electrons exciting and then de-exciting and emitting a photon of light as a result, a wavelength of light as a result. And I don't know about you, but I think this is pretty cool. Hopefully you found that useful. If you want to see more on a discussion of electrons and their energy levels, then do check out uh, the video that I've already made um, that discusses that as part of the radioactivity topic. Till then, see ya! But this works best uh, with the lights dimmed, so